Welcome to Commencement. I'm Soraya Coley, President of Cal Poly Pomona. We are proud to celebrate this milestone in our students' educational adventure. Inside these buildings around you, generations of innovative thinkers and leaders have emerged. We seek to instill the joy of lifelong learning, a passion for leadership, and membership in a global society. It is my hope that today's graduates continue to find joy in discovering new ideas and making an impact in their communities. When we look down the road, we have to think about our future students. In the blink of an eye, these precious children around me will become our future Broncos. As a public institution, we have a responsibility and a moral obligation to provide access and educational opportunities to our children. Future generations must have the opportunity to receive a quality education, to make a difference in their communities, and to fulfill their dreams. Let us celebrate the many achievements of this year's graduating class. Each one of you has played a role in our students' lives. Thank you for your support and investment. This moment is as much yours as it is theirs. I think our graduates are eager to begin the ceremony, so let's welcome them in. Congratulations, graduates!
Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. Blake Say will lead us in the singing of the national anthem. Gentlemen, please remove your hats. Oh, say can you see by the dawn's early light what so proudly we hailed at the twilight's last gleaming whose broad stripes and bright stars through the perilous fight or the ramparts we watched were so gallantly streaming and the rocket's red glare the bombs bursting in air gave proof through the night that our flag was still there Oh, say does that star-spangled banner yet wave O'er the land of the free And the home of the Thank you, Blake, for that inspirational performance. I am Dr. Leah Dobson, Dean and James A. Collins Distinguished Chair of the Collins College of Hospitality Management. Welcome to our 2017 commencement. On behalf of the faculty, staff, and students of the college, I offer congratulations to our graduates and a special welcome to their families and friends who join us today. It gives me great pleasure to introduce the distinguished members of the platform party. I ask that each of them stand as I read their names, but please hold your applause until they have all been introduced. Ms. Danielle Manning, VP for Administrative Affairs. Mr. Danielle. Mont Pleasure, VP for University Advancement. Dr. Eddie Mao, Department Chair for the Collins College of Hospitality Management. Dr. Neha Singh, Associate Professor, Academic Center, Senator and Director of Graduate Studies for the Collins College of Hospitality Management. Malia Ray Silverman, our Senior Class Representative. John Gilbert, hospitality executive with over four decades of experience and chair of the Student Success Committee of the Collins College Board of Advisors. Lyra Zelenskaya, operations director for City Club Los Angeles and president of the Collins Hospitality Society alumni chapter. Belinda Gonda, our 2017 valedictorian. Manny Hernandez, our 2017 Julian A. McPhee Scholar. Jane W. Carney, JD, a member of the California State University Board of Trustees. Dr. Soraya Coley, President of California State Polytechnic University, Pomona. Dr. Sylvia Alva, Provost and Vice President for Academic Affairs. Eva Wasserman, our commencement speaker, proud alumna, and chair of the development committee of the Collins College Board of Advisors and managing director of Jim Realty Capital, Inc. And Michael Godfrey, associate dean of the Collins College of Hospitality Management. Thank you all very much for being with us. Please be seated. Now, I would also like to introduce some special guests who are with us today. Mr. Roger Hill, Hill, our commencement speaker, Eva Wasserman's husband, and chairman CEO of the Gettys Group, who has been a generous supporter of our college. 
distinguished members of the Collins College Board of Advisors, Mr. Steve Burns, Vice President of Operations, Cisco, Los Angeles. Paul Kramer, proud alum and founder of Farrell's Restaurants. And finally, our beloved Mr. Jim Collins, namesake of the college and founding member of the college's Board of Advisors, who can't be with us today, but he has a special message for all of you. Welcome to the Collins College graduates tonight. Congratulations to the class of 2017. You can be very proud of what you've achieved here at the university, and we are certainly very proud of you. Uh, I can't wait to find out a little bit more about what's gonna happen in the future, and I know you're anticipating that for yourselves. You're gonna have a, a wonderful time, and uh, you're gonna be looking back and thinking about the time you spent here at Cal Poly. We wanna wish you the very best of luck in your future endeavors, and, and hope that you'll come back from time to time and let us know how you're doing. Thanks for the time you spent here, and good luck to you as you move through your pathway of life. Well, congratulations, class of 2017. You made it. You've excelled and are graduating from one of the nation's premier hospitality management colleges. Our programs, led by internationally recognized faculty, have been consistently ranked in the top 10 hospitality and tourism management programs in the country. That is something to be proud of. And you will be forever regarded as a member of the growing Collins College family. We are known as the global leaders in hospitality education because of graduates like you who go into the world and make a difference. Today, that is what I challenge you to do. Make a difference. Don't be afraid to make a positive and significant impact on the world. Take calculated risks to change the world for the better and be confident in your choices. As Ellen DeGeneres, also known as Dory, once said, when you take risks, you learn that there will be times when you succeed and there will be times when you fail. And both are equally important. Face your challenges head on and allow others to help you along the way. Remember, just keep swimming, just keep swimming. However, if you happen to be a bit unsecure of your future, don't worry. Maya Angela once said, nothing can dim the light that shines from within. Know that your inner light shines bright and can make the world a better place. Burst into greatness and it will propel you. It has been an honor serving as your dean, and I have enjoyed getting to know each of you. My commitment to you is that we will continue to move forward and make the degrees you are receiving today more and more valuable as time moves on. Thank you. At this time, I would like to acknowledge our wonderful Collins College faculty. Would you all please stand and be recognized? Thank you. Now I would like to highlight a few faculty and staff who have had special points of distinction this year. I ask that each of them stand as I read their names. Dr. Michelle Yu. Congratulations for being honored as the Collins College Faculty Advisor of the Year. Dr. Eddie Mao. Dr. Mao is our first ever department chair for the Collins College of Hospitality Management. Ann Laura. Carolina Sanchez. And James Yokoyama. Congratulations for being selected as the Cal Poly Pomona's Outstanding Advising Program for 2017. And I also want to thank Carolina Sanchez and Linda Garcia for their tireless work in making today's festivities a success. 
Now I'd like to welcome President Coley to say a few words. President Coley. Thank you, Dean Dobson. Hello, Cal Poly Pomona class of 2017. You did it. And on behalf of our outstanding faculty and staff, I congratulate you. I applaud your accomplishments and relay our pride in you. I would like to thank CSU trustee Jane Carney for participating in today's commencement ceremonies. We appreciate the efforts of our trustees to attend commencement ceremonies at all 23 campuses to join in the celebration of the more than 110,000 students who are graduating across the CSU this year. Thank you, Trustee Carney. I would also like to thank the members of the Collins College Board of Advisors for joining us today to celebrate this momentous occasion with the Collins College graduates. And Eva, we appreciate you and Roger making the trip from Chicago. Thank you all. <laughs> Getting to this milestone was not easy, but you persisted, and here you are today. I want each of you to take a moment to think about the people who helped you get here. I know that they are beaming with pride, your family, your friends, teachers, coaches, counselors, and others. Let's offer them a round of applause. There are also people you might not know, such as alumni and other donors, whose support helped make your education possible. The best way to thank them is to pay it forward. And even though others may have supported you, it is you who had to show up to class, you had to master the material and challenge yourself. You set your mind to the goal and achieved it. It is no small thing to earn a degree. It takes perseverance and a sense of purpose. My hope is that you will carry the joy you feel today into the world of work or into furthering your education. And as you move into the next phase of your life's journey, let me share several essential lessons that I've learned. The first is to hold high expectations for yourself. If you have low expectations, you will behave in ways that don't make a difference. Set the bar high and exercise the discipline needed to achieve success. The second is to take action. Don't let a fear of failure inhibit you. Unless you move in the direction of your expectations, you will not be successful. The third is to be persistent. Success isn't always easy or even guaranteed. Know that every failure holds a lesson. Learn from it. The fourth is to maintain options. Earning a degree opens up possibilities. Look for opportunities to grow and adapt to the changes throughout your lifetime. And finally, discover your purpose. Why are you here? Your talents and gifts are still developing. Be open to new experiences and make choices that align with your curiosity and passions. Some of you may know or have a clear path toward that understanding. For others, it may take longer. But recognize that you are always in the act of creating and choosing. Seek to discover and let the, the greatness unfold, the greatness that lies within each of you. Be bold in your pursuit and strive to be your best and authentic self. In closing, I'd like to share these passages from a piece written by educator and author Dennis Kimbrough. 
May you develop a burning desire that is required of all achievement. May you stand up for the rights of others against the undesirable influence and threats of enemies. May you save your money so that you could pay your way in this world and yet be generous to those in need. May you forgive and forget those that may have harmed you. May you accept full responsibilities for the successes as well as for the failures in your life. May you know that the greatest challenge is understanding. The greatest mistake is conformity. The greatest strength is faith. The greatest weakness is pride. The greatest day is today. The greatest word is thanks. The greatest among us is whoever serves. The greatest message is hope. The greatest of these is love and empathy. Congratulations, class of 2017. We're so proud of you. Thank you, President Coley. It is now my pleasure to introduce Jane W. Carney, a member of the California State University Board of Trustees. We are honored to have you with us today. Trustee Carney. Thank you, Dean Dobson. It's a real pleasure to be here with you on this important and celebratory occasion. I bring you greetings from the California State University and the other 22 campuses of it. I extend, of course, my congratulations to you, the graduates of the Co Collins College of Hospitality Management. As citizens and future alumni of California State University, I encourage all of you to continue to support the university and its mission. Help keep the doors of opportunity open to those students who will follow you. You will soon learn the real benefits of earning a degree from the California State University as you go out into the workforce, a workforce that depends so greatly on well-prepared CSU graduates. Be proud that you are joining the class of 2017 CSU alums as you cross this stage tonight. As a graduate and a member of your community, I hope that you will help prospective students who perhaps don't know the ropes of getting into college and how to succeed here. Show them how you did it and help them see how they can do it too. Finally, I ask you to be an ambassador for our university. Let your friends and colleagues, legislators and community know how important the CSU has been to you. Again, congratulations and best wishes to all of you. Thank you, Trustee Carney. It is my pleasure to introduce Malia Ray Silverman, the senior class representative who will present the senior class gift. Malia Silverman has been a dedicated student leader throughout the course of her college career. In addition to being one of the faces of the college, college as a Collins ambassador, she was the vice president of the Hospitality Management Council and president of her sorority, Sigma Kappa. Malia kept her grades up while staying involved in various clubs on campus, including the Ada Sigma Delta International Hospitality Management Honor Society the Cal Poly Hospitality Association, and the National Society of Minorities in Hospitality. She's shown dedication to her career, even as a full-time student with experience working in companies, including Hilton Worldwide, Tanea Lodge, and La Quinta and Inn and Suites. Malia has secured her dream job post-graduation at the Montage Deer Valley Resort in Utah as a rooms manager. Please welcome Malia. President Coley, Dean Dobson, distinguished guests, and fellow members of the class of 2017. Every year, the graduating class leaves behind something for the campus community, a gift for future generations of Broncos. It's about leaving the university better than it was when we first got here. This tradition succeeds every year because of another tradition at Cal Poly Pomona, philanthropy. Look around you now for those of us wearing the senior class gift donor pin. These graduates have made an important investment in the future of our university. 
This year, our giving will provide funding for the brand new Emerging Scholars Program, a scholarship for students who are the first in their family to attend college and who need the support. Fellow donors, thank you for your gen generous spirit. President Coley, I am honored to present this gift from the class of 2017. Thank you, Malia, and also thank you, the graduates. This is such a generous gift, and it will certainly provide a strong foundation for future Broncos. Thank you so much. Each year at commencement, the Collins College of Hospitality Management recognizes the undergraduate with the highest grade point average as its valedictorian. Belinda Gonda has earned the best grades of her class of 2017 with a 3.98 GPA. <laughs> Belinda has made both her family in Indonesia and her Collins College family here in the U.S. proud with her dedication to outstanding ex academic excellence. After graduation, she plans to work in the food and beverage sector of the industry with hopes to one day open her own restaurant or cafe where people can hang out with friends while enjoying a high quality meal. Her previous work experience includes management positions for restaurants in Indonesia. Belinda shines at the top of her class and we are excited to see where her career journey continues to take her. Please join me in congratulating Belinda Gonda as the 2017 Collins College of Hospitality Management Valedictorian. Thank you. Now I'd like to recognize our Kellogg Honors College graduates. Please stand when you hear your name. Christian Fang. <laughs> Melissa Wong. <laughs> Margaret Ruers. <laughs> and Lucas Meats. Congratulations on your accomplishments. Please be seated. The Collins College also honors a student with the Julian A. McPhee Award for Overall Student Excellence. The McPhee Award is named after the founding president of Cal Poly Pomona and Cal Poly San Luis Obispo. It is given a recognition of a student's outstanding academic achievement and service to the college. Manny. Each year, the faculty and staff nominate one student to receive the McPhee Award and provide commencement address to fellow students. Manny Hernandez is this year's award recipient. He has excelled academically, been a leader among his peers, and has fully embraced all the opportunities we provide students at the college. <laughs> Manny Hernandez is the epitome of hospitality while balancing his studies, leadership roles on campus, and working in the industry. He always finds time to share a smile and give a helping hand to fellow students, colleagues, and the campus community. Manny served as the president of the Hospitality Management Council and as Collins College ambassador his senior year at Cal Poly Pomona. He was also the treasurer of the Club Managers Association of America and a member of the Pi Kappa Phi fraternity. His list of professional experiences is comprised of top hospitality management companies, including Marriott International, Morongo Casino Resort and Spa, and the Riviera Country Club. Thanks to connections he made at the Collins College, Manny has accepted a position after graduation with Marriott International's Voyage Program at the Southwest Group Sales Office. Congratulations, Manny. President Coley, will you please join us at the podium to present Manny with the McPhee Award.
<laughs> Thank you, uh, President Coley and Dean Dobbs. Good evening. What a great honor it is to be up here speaking to every single one of you. <laughs> if there's something that most people know about me is that I have an extreme love for my Colombian culture. So today, before we leave Cal Poly Pomona, I would like to give you one final lesson in Colombian terminology 101. Let's begin with Berraquera. We use this word to describe an individual who has the strength and drive to overcome obstacles life presents. The strength to stand up when everything attempts to bring you down. I found no better way to describe students from the Collins College other than having a whole lot of this berraquera. We <laughs> We all chose a major and career that requires tons of hard work, dedication, drive, and selflessness. It's a great quality that we all share. We also shared this memorable journey through Cal Poly Pomona. Together we learned the true meaning of hospitality, generosity, respect, and camaraderie. Generosity, as exemplified by our amazing faculty and staff, sharing their knowledge, time, and commitment to our success. Respect as we learned to work with one another, learned from each other, and learned to value the diversity of our Collins family. And lastly, hospitality is camaraderie. As we pushed each other to climb those 70 steps to class every single day. The Collins College opened its doors to each of us in the most hospitable way. And today we step out of those doors, portraying what hospitality truly is. Let's continue our lesson in Colombian terminology with the word parranda. Pure celebration. This day is about recognizing the hard work, the commitment, the sacrifices, and the dedication it took to get to this amazing, achievement that requires parranda. I encourage you to celebrate others who helped us get, he, get us here as well. I want to thank my parents for the amazing example and their constant support, my family and friends for pushing me and inspiring me to reach limits that I did not know I had. For all of you, I am extremely grateful. In closing, I would like to encourage you to reflect on your journey keep your berraquera alive, and celebrate this great accomplishment in true parranda. The same strength and dedication that got you here today will get you to great places in each one of your futures. I wish you all the best of luck in your future endeavors, and congratulations, class of 2017. We finally did it. Thank you, Manny, and congratulations. It is now my privilege to introduce our special guest and commencement speaker, Eva Wasserman. Eva is a proud alumna and chair of the Development Committee of the Collins College Board of Advisors. She is the managing director of Jim Realty Capital, a private equity real estate firm responsible for numerous hotels and resorts throughout the United States. She has been actively involved in the hospitality industry for over 25 years and was previously principal of State Parkway Advisory, an investment and consulting firm, where she provided asset management services to various portfolios exceeding $1.5 billion. Eva has also held leadership roles with Hilton, Strategic Hotel Capital, the Yarmouth Group, Kenneth Leventhal and Company, and Leventhal and Horowitz. As a proud alumni, Eva has given back to her alma mater by serving on the President's National Development Council for Cal Poly Pomona and as Vice Chair of Foundation Giving for Cal Poly Pomona's Comprehensive Campaign. 
Eva continuously shows her dedication to shaping the future of hospitality leaders by engaging with our students here at the Collins College. Please welcome Eva Wasserman. Thank you, President Coley, Dean Dobson, faculty, staff, parents, families, friends. Good evening and congratulations to the Collins College of Hospitality Management, Class of 2017. It is a tremendous honor to be here today addressing all of you. When I was asked by Dean Dobson to speak today, I was excited by the opportunity, and then reality hit me. What am I going to say to you today at this very important point in your life? What do I want my message to be? I graduated in 1986 and cannot adequately put into words how proud I am to be an alumni of this amazing program. Since I stood here 31 years ago, the Collins College has grown in size, reputation, and excellence. You have the benefit of learning in an amazing environment with expert professors and a spectacular culture, all which polytechnic education offers. You have developed your skills through practical experience and are extremely well prepared to start your careers in the hospitality field. Through hard work and perseverance, you have accomplished your goal and the goal of your family for you. Looking back, I can keenly remember the concerns I had at graduation. Excited to be done with college, anxious to get to work, uncertain about what my future might bring, and how I could be a better person. As it has turned out, I have a fantastic, fulfilling career in the hotel industry, and I'm currently a managing director at a private equity real estate firm responsible for numerous hotels and resorts located throughout the United States. A rare position for a woman. <laughs> I have a wonderful family and the best network of friends anybody could ask for. Lucky? Yes, in part. But I strongly believe in hard work and caring about and for others. It could be the era I was raised in, but I believe John F. Kennedy had a keen sense of what we needed in our society. He said, let us think of education as the means of developing our greatest abilities, because in each of us, there is a private hope and dream, which fulfilled can be translated into benefit for everyone. Kennedy's words speak to the possibility that education fulfills a greater need than just an individual's desire for self-improvement, enlightenment, or the possibility of amazing career, but rather, through education and achieving our dreams and goals, we can help each other and make a difference for many. This is what I want to share with you today, the conviction that we can all help each other. When I was a student at Cal Poly, the program was much smaller with only four full-time faculty. One of the faculty, Dr. Leslie Stevens, started chatting with me one day after class. And after learning, I had a real interest in becoming a consultant to the hospitality industry. She immediately encouraged me to apply for an internship that was being offered at a major national accounting firm. She pushed me quickly to apply as the process was well underway and close to wrapping up. She set up my interview and off to downtown LA I went. I actually interviewed with Don St. Hilaire. <laughs> it was... <laughs> I was offered the internship that changed my life. 
That internship grew into a full-time job, and within a few years, the position I had achieved was higher than my peers with MBAs. How fortunate was I that a faculty member here at Cal Poly took the time that day to talk to me and listened to what I was saying. The education and faculty support I received during my time at Cal Poly changed my future, prepared me for success, and set me on the perfect path. I know my experience is not an isolated occurrence and that all of you have benefited from someone going out of their way to make an introduction, teach you something, provide an internship, offer to be a mentor, training you on the job, or providing financial support. Maybe all, or at least a combination of those, you have benefited from while at the Collins College. A famous poet, Ralph Waldo Emerson, wrote, in the order of nature, we cannot render benefits to those from who we receive them, or only seldom. But the benefit we receive must be rendered again and again, line for line, deed for deed, cent for cent, to somebody. What is Emerson saying? Well, the more current term for this philosophy is pay it forward. Rather than paying it back to the person that gave it to you, pay it forward to another. The executive that mentored you, what can you do to repay their kindness in time? On the surface, it could be very difficult to do anything short of sending a thank you note, which I happen to know Dr. Jones would hound you about if you didn't do it. The perfect repayment would be mentoring someone yourself. Now that's paying it forward. Early in my career, my boss, Rob Klein, spent many hours training me how to be the best hotel asset manager. He taught me everything I needed to know and was ruthless about reviewing my work to ensure it was perfect. It would be impossible for me to pay that back directly to him. But when we hired a bright young woman one year out of undergrad, I in turn spent hours working closely with her and mentoring her to become an excellent hotel asset manager. She has become a top leader in our industry. I look at her and I feel confident that I did pay it forward. One of the most inspiring people I have the honor of knowing that embodies pay it forward is Jim Collins, the college's namesake. Yeah. Early in his career, he was building his first restaurant, and the person from the DWP, the Department of Water and Power, started talking to him about what he was creating, and in hearing it, encouraged Jim to go out and see a hamburger stand out in San Bernardino. So he took Jim out to San Bernardino, and that's where he saw, for the first time, the McDonald's hamburger stand. This inspired him to make changes to the restaurant he was developing, Hamburger Handout. He has been amazingly successful within the food service industry and now actively gives back in numerous ways including supporting the education of students like yourselves that are interested in the hospitality industry. He actively shares his experience, knowledge, and business acumen with many. Seven out of 10 students at the Collins College benefits directly from financial support. I love that statistic, 70% of you. All of you have benefited from a university that receives $20 million per year in private donations, keeping tuition down and supporting programs on campus. That support, by the way, comes in all forms of major gifts, from 
major gifts to small amounts that help provide a meaningful education for all of you. My education here was the start of a tremendous career. Doors opened by faculty created opportunities that have led to my success. The wonderful thing about the hospitality industry, there are so many interesting paths to success, you only need to find the one that suits you. The two things our industry demands, though, is hard work and dedication. Graduating today displays that you all have the ability to persevere. As you begin this next phase of your life, I ask you all to be mindful of those that helped you to get to where you are today and that you pay it forward. You can be the person that mentors a younger or less experienced person or helps to train a fellow team member, encourages a new hire at work. Stay connected to your fellow alumni and network, network, network. Life is better when we support each other. As a fellow alumni, we all have so much to be proud of as graduates of the Collins College. Class of 2017, I salute all of you for your accomplishments and wish you all the best for your future. And what should you do? Thank you. Thank you so much, Eva. Those were very inspirational words. I now call, call upon the University Provost and Vice President for Academic, Academic Affairs, Dr. Sylvia Alva, to present the candidates for the master's degrees. Provost Alva. Well, the candidates for the degree of Master of Science in Hospitality Management, please rise. President Coley, I present to you the candidates for the Master of Science in Hospitality Management. These candidates have completed the requirements for the master's degree as prescribed by the State of California and the trustees of the California State University. And they have been recommended for their degree by the faculty of California State Polytechnic University, Pomona. Candidates for the master's degree, you have heard the recommendation of the faculty of California State Polytechnic University, Pomona. By the authority vested in me as president, I confer upon you the degree of Master of Science in Hospitality Management with all the rights, honors, and responsibilities appertaining thereto. Congratulations. Director of Graduate Studies, Dr. Neha Singh, and Department Chair, Dr. Eddie Mao, will have the honor of hooding our graduate students. Will the faculty please take your places in the aisle? Jacqueline Bastavus. Alicia? Alicia Dimbalian.
Murchtetek Unur Bayaskalan. Ling Wan. Araya Rojanapiram. I now ask Provost Alva to present the candidates for the baccalaureate degree. Provost Alva. Well, the candidates for the degree of Bachelor of Science in Hospitality Management, please rise. <laughs> President Coley. I present to you the candidates for the baccalaureate degree from the Collins College of Hospitality Management. These candidates have completed the requirements for the baccalaureate degree as prescribed by the State of California and the trustees of the California State System. And they have been recommended for their degree by the faculty of California State Polytechnic University, Pomona. Candidates for the baccalaureate degree, you have heard the recommendation of the faculty of California State Polytechnic University, Pomona. By the authority vested in me as president, I confer upon you the degree of Bachelor of Science in Hospitality Management with all the rights, honors, and responsibilities appertaining thereto. Congratulations. Now, in academic tradition, the student who has not yet earned a degree wears the tassel on the mortarboard on the right side. When the degree is conferred, the scholar moves the tassel to the left and joins a select company. In recognition of your new status, will all the recipients of the baccalaureate degree move the tassel to the left. To the class of 2017, I commend you for your effort and accomplishments. Give yourselves a hand. Please be seated. <laughs> I now ask our valedictorian, McPhee Scholar, and senior class representative to lead the lineup of their classmates for the baccalaureate presentation. I ask the students follow the staff's direction to the lineup. Will the faculty members participating in the presentation please take your places on the stage? Will the faculty please take your places in the aisle?
Belinda Ganda, summa cum laude. Manuel F. Hernandez Arenas. Malia Ray Silverman, cum laude. Melody Sue. Darian Marie Grainer. Chad Michael Volkertz. Jocelyn, Wa Jocelyn Wachin. Eric Allen Trout. Lynn Liu. Hui Joy Wu. Melissa Picasso. Anayeli DeLewis. Ariel Adasa Bertolano. Mia Monique Sorcaro Guzman, cum laude. Janae Ashley Mata. Fiona Ying Wong, cum laude. Kathleen Claire Donovan. Ying Liang, cum laude. Crystal Camarena. Noelle Elizabeth Getz. James Edward Brown. Margaret Catherine Ruers, magna cum laude, Kellogg Honors Scholar. Bailey Renee Epperson, summa cum laude. Crystal Yvonne Garcia. Sarah Shelley. Caitlin Brooke Walker. Shelby Lynn Depry. Krista Bree Johnson. Heather Letizio. Bethany Ann Kono. Janelle Renee Garcia. Gina Kim. Christian Javier Mejia. Carissa Leah Perlas. Jennifer Nicole Prieto Menendez. Ronald Kwong. Ada Hong K. Wong. Rachel Marie Watts. Connie Chris Chan. Jennifer Campo. Ashley Danielle Oriana. Lucas Jotes Smeets, cum laude, Kellogg Honors Scholar. Erica Christine Delgado. James G. Castillo. Andrew Duong. Vince Yan. Brenda Elizabeth Wong. Marissa Kuruki. Ariel Tan, magna cum laude. Jacqueline Andrea Sadiq. Lauren Michelle Head, magna cum laude. Lorraine Hodge. Vivian Hana Na. Shu Ting Yang, magna cum laude. Nina Dung. Violet Azucena Sevillano. Emily Pichardo. Maria Allegre. Abigail Zemus, cum laude. Stella Augustina Eng. Marley Shireen Ledesma. June Pham. Ishan Chandra Goose. Katrina Camacho. Javier De Leon. Andrea Rachel Danny. Simone Bradford Kushner, cum laude. Nicholas Jordan Chambers. Devin Tiedemann. Aaron John Lucella. Mendy Huang. Adrian Angel Rivas. Zachary Lamb. Lauren Nicole Gonzalez. Melissa Ching Ching Wong, magna cum laude, Kellogg Honors. Taylor Ray Whistler. Alyssa Francois. Blake Austin Say, magna cum laude. Andrew Mondragon. Julia Renee Redman. Martin Jose Ramirez. Kevin Rosas. Aliyah Hassan. Brian Son Fan. Elizabeth Mendoza. David G. Gu Kim. Alyssa Nicole Henderson. Alex Ryan Gardere. Kirsten April Combs, cum laude. Edward Anthony Inglesi. Rafael Agustin Carrera. Adrian Wong. Jeanette Cedeno. Jonathan Camacho Rios. Alexis Martinez. Jessica Carey Johnson. Sarah Pannoni, Kellogg Honors. Ashley Caprice Smith. Fiona Marie Byrne. Brandon Michael Boland. Rachel Angela Hines, magna cum laude. Nicolette Victoria Badoyan. Mohanad Alatig. Kara Marie Stanton. Akram Shaheen. 
Othman Banani. Jessica Farias. Vanessa Marie Torres. Elise Hennel Inselberg. Aliyah Brown. Leslie Simone. Lauren Page McDaniels. James Lawrence Maher. Lavinia Hernandez Michel. Mary Elizabeth Rainey. Stephanie Arteaga. Sabrina Ann Ponte. Russell Santos, cum laude. Erin Nicole Buckner. Ruth Rivas, cum laude. Samantha Alicia Cordera. Kimberlina Diaz Escalera. Tasha Lynn French. Henry Hugh Pham, magna cum laude. Alexis Rose Sackett. Alexia Asuline. Brandon Huang. Natalie Rose Turner. Rochelle Bautista, magna cum laude. Jenny Tong, cum laude. Noor Hussam Shihayab. Christina Romanov. Issei Tuji. David John Olson. Alyssa Hillary Hammond. Stephen Zaid Kobar. Heather Renee DaCosta. Gabriel Quintero. Taylor Kentaro Taniguchi. Candy Wang. Jillian Catherine Nicholson. Debbie Kim. Heather Caitlin Wurst. Jennifer Tiffany Chan. Veronica Chan. Carrie Wang. Mariana Olisiuk, cum laude. Janine Andrea Solon. Brittany Renee Romo. Jessica Michelle Corsio. Vanessa Renee Vaca. Natalia Gabriella Corvini. Ashlyn Parker. Francesca Isabel Labaki. Sarah Lieberman, magna cum laude. Joseph Xavier Herrera. Denise Meyer. Kayleen Marchuk. Madison Rocker. Jamie Nicole Kompleski. Annika Michaela Monteleone. Jacqueline Gonzalez Salgado. Kaylin Agosti. Alondra Lopez. Demi Kathleen Glassman. Caroline Tran. Alexis Monique Montano. Lauren Carley. Maria Evangelina Razo Ayon. Bern Greider. Michael D. Lee. Patrick Cho. Amanda Janine Nagy. Doris Tam. Vivian Lan Vu. Diana Abundis, cum laude. Agopi Kali Hajian. Aristides Ruiz. Jacinta Marie Jackson. Kelly Kylie Liu. Kenna Hop Truong. Mayumi Crystal Naganishi, magna cum laude. Allison Yu. Alexandria Michelle Millette. Dana Bossi. Lee Knight. Tina Lin. Rianne Twynum. Maria Guadalupe Rodriguez. Ted Aung. Mariana Castro. Stella Natalia, cum laude. Diego Alejandro Garcia. Debbie Budiono. Miguel Angel Garcia. Audrey Nguyen. Sophia Laura Van Vascus. Nicole Don Gilmore. Anthony Tan Nguyen. Hector Ortiz. Johnny Kua. Roberta Fernanda Oriana. Brianna Loben, cum laude. Berenice Valencia. Vanessa Davila. Judy Zhao. Kathleen June Kang. Cameron Respicio. Petty Tai. Mira Nabil Hanna. Amanda Moria Stewart. Yvette Gomez. 
Catherine Gallegos. Erica Lopez. Brooke Sahar Fortsi. Cody Allen Waters. Ali Shaolai Leong. Celeste Britt. Kevin Charles Trimmer. Hannah Rose Bowles. <laughs> Nolan James O'Connell. <laughs> Marlon Marin Rodriguez. Michelle Huang. Monica Victoria Dawson. Brian Cradifil. Thomas Dion Watkins. Juliana Canellos. David Sharp. Lauren Kai Jabin. Lauren Alicia Tustin. Enemy Zhang Fang. Benjamin Fang. Marissa Aurora Madrigal. Soon Ji Sydney Park. Angela Mei Feng Chow. Christine Dang. Ivan Chiang. Thank you. Si Chen. Thank you. Fang Wen Han. Lulu Dong. Jun Shin La. Heidi Huang. Pan Wei. Wei Ting Jin. Ding Li Yao. Bradley Palmer. Jeremy Lewis Prickett. Joanna Stanley, summa cum laude, President's Council Scholar. Christina Marie Gingrich. Victoria Hernandez. Vanessa Ortiz. Alexis Leona Martinez. Manuela Roshi Pineda Molina. Vin Nguyen. Diana Alejandra Courage. Ming Lu Leon. Danessa Marie Villafranca Lacap. Blair Laner Wolford. Vivian Ramirez Castaneda. Rita Esther Torres. Daryl Andrew Ballaret. Tanya Veronica Perez. Jacob Daniel Fuete, magna cum laude. Kyla Barbosa. Claire Danielle Toledo. Alexander Scott King. Tiffany Chung. Courtney Guerrero. Tiffany Hua. Tiana Grace Rodriguez Stewart. Lekhana Sokom. Lyle Tang. Sarah Michelle Rangwala. Ki Min. Kimberly Sue Nyholt. Chao Wei Wu. Carissa Marie Melton. Julie Chang. Aaron Fleming. Wing Q Lee. Lindell Francesco Serrano, summa cum laude. Y Yan Vivian Chow. Catherine Riley Nelson. Summer Y Sum Chan. Yu Ting Q. Jonathan Seung Hoon Kim. Nova Zhang. Rafi Araxian. Yurin Guadalupe Mendoza Sanchez. Brian Ni. Nee. Yuru Jiang Cum Laude. Hyulim Lee. Martha Elkiri Monroy. Anna Hyin Kim. Brianna Victoria Diaz. Jane Sung Hee Lee. Janae Danielle Kellogg. Hei Won Han. Clarissa Margaret North. Zheng Zheng Chen. Zeeling Stephanie Lai. Heymar So. Annie Lin. Jennifer Marisol Duarte. Lauren Lin. Samantha Korn. Jimmy Huang. Nicole Marie Hovan. Chok Yum King, magna cum laude. Alexis Elizabeth Caputo, summa cum laude. Alex Yoon So Yu. Brendan Ian Patrick Valdez. Abigail Kim. Paul Ockeltree, cum laude. BJ Sa. Jelani Gervais Rice. Thomas Vang. Christian Casey Fang, Kellogg Honors. Sylvia Adelina Zuniga. Hannah Gail Garvin. Stanley Wu. 
Carissa Joanna Sells. Fan Yun Chu. Lisa Lin Honda. Joyce Lee. Yun Su Lee. Han Siak Justin Lee. Veronica Snell. Day In Park. Elizabeth Joanna Dominguez. Jai Shen. Miguel Angel Avila. Carolyn Zhao. Angie Hong. Christy Situ. Vivian Han Yu. Geraldo Rivera. Dallas Becerra. Elton Chuang. Bin Dang. Jerry Chang. Alex Chan. Ga Hong Leong. Tessa Stangel. Atikar Ladasuntorn. Caitlin G. McKenzie. Caitlin Mitsuyo Likata. Cameron Iwanga. Quinn Lee. Catherine Ann Hayes. Brian John Tong. Zhu Yan Yang, magna cum laude. Alfino Putra, magna cum laude. Zi Yu Huang. Nikki Lee, summa cum laude. William Hua. Esther Huang. Christine Pokies Bagaigai. Mary Ann Mack. Everyone, please join me in congratulating the Collins College of Hospitality Management's Class of 2017. <laughs> Thank you. Please be seated. Graduates, we thank you for all that you have done in your studies, your work, and your student organizations. I especially want to thank you for your dedication to the Collins College of Hospitality Management. You are our newest leaders, and we are anticipating great things from you as you shape the future of hospitality. You have now earned membership into a welcoming society of more than 5,000 Collins College alumni working in the hospitality industry throughout the world. We are so proud of your accomplishments, and we wish you all the best. Congratulations on your graduation, and thank you for being with us for this joyful celebration. Audience, please remain seated during the recessional. Mace bearer, please retrieve the mace. 